Kidney disease patients below the age of 18 and above 60 years who visited the dialysis unit of Kolobu Teaching Hospital had to pay for their dialysis treatment despite the free treatment announced, announcement made by the National Health Insurance Authority. Patients between the ages of 19 and 59 who were supposed to receive two free dialysis sessions per month are also yet to enjoy the free sessions. I went to the renal centre at the Kolobu Teaching Hospital to find out if the situation still persists. The government, through the National Health Insurance Authority, announced that effective June 1 to December 2024, renal patients below 18 and above 60 would receive all eight dialysis sessions per month free, and patients between 19 and 59 years would receive two free dialysis sessions per month. However, patients are still paying. Despite assurances by the National Health Insurance Authority that patients who paid 491 Ghana cities for their dialysis treatment from Monday, June 3, would be reimbursed, renal patients at Kolebu Teaching Hospital are skeptical that the directive will be implemented. I'm to say, yeah, from 20 to 59, it's two sessions. But I'm going to start in the metria. We had twice a week. But if it is January, basically, I never more than my mini yesikema to me banner once a week, every Thursday. And I remember Dr. Mamatia says about Konami and a week me and Mammy near home one day and try to be a December. No, met in a free chain. Send me be beyond yet. And then Kabam Bob Way and the any one chain or near chim. A month, no, a year, eight times. Nine could not for four. Nine and for four. Then how much did you pay? Four ninety one. My receipt is in my back. For now, they haven't come out to tell us when they are starting the free for us. So, for now, I can't tell. We are the June is still young, and I don't know when to be starting. It has really affected me, and it's affecting me. On Monday, I was supposed to come. But because of money, I couldn't come. Today is my next section. I was able to get money to come. Government should come into our aid and support, or even make it free for us, not only for the six months. The money has already gone into the system. So I'm not sure. The, the only thing I think or know they can do is that since they said they'll be giving us two sessions, the June is so young. So they can say, okay, then le next week, all my two sessions, I shouldn't pay. Yeah, I think that's the only thing. But for the refund, I'm not sure. I don't even have hope on it. I'm not sure. It's not easy. Unless I have 600 cities before I'll be able to come for one session. Yeah, so the two sessions, 1,002. If I don't get 1,002 in a week, I'm not able to die like this. Like the EPO, yes, you'll be taking, you'll be buying BP drugs and other stuff. It's not easy. So you should do something about it. The spokesperson for the Renal Patients Association, Kojo Bafua Hinkra, says that although they are grateful for the NHIA's assistance, beyond December, the government should focus on subsidizing the cost and buying new dialysis machines. It's not a bad idea. If somebody to help you for a dialysis, even one session, you have saved your life. So for the two out of the eight, that is not what we, ask, we, we want. That is not what we want. Honestly, we also want the free eight session because I keep telling you, you know, that it's not only the dialysis. The injection is there. The labs are there, the medications are there. That one alone costs a lot. So uh, we, we, we appreciate what the National Health Insurance and the government have done. Like Oliver Twist said, we really want more. There's more, especially we need more machines. There are no machines here. The machines here is about 10 or 11, doing about 400 patients. Yeah, if the machines have more, they could have talked that they are tired. Channel One news sources at Kolebu Teaching Hospital say that the facility is yet to receive a directive from the Ministry of Health and will only cease collecting the dialysis cost of 491 Ghana cities 
when it hears from the Ministry of Health. Several days after the National Health Insurance Authority announced free dialysis sessions for certain categories of people, checks at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital show that they continue to pay the 491 Ghana cities required for their dialysis treatment. Now the renal patients, they're calling on the government to come to their aid so that they can receive the critical care that they need. Reporting for Channel 1 News, my name is Enusafo.